Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, slow. Advancing diversity, equity, and inclusion in San Luis Obispo cannot happen in a vacuum. It requires the collective force of everyone who cares about the well being of our community, of our leaders, of our innovators, of our youth. It requires all of you. There are tools and frameworks and guides to help us change our perspectives, right? And transform our company cultures to be more customer centric and think more holistically about the memorable experiences that we can create with our brand. There's nothing like a great crisis to shake up how we're working and operating and allow us to discover and embrace new ways of operating. It's 2021 and there's a whole wide world of gender out there, an entire spectrum between and outside of and including both man and woman. The current aerospace industry is around $350 billion a year and is projected to grow to $2.7 trillion in the next three decades. This community is set up better than just about anywhere in the country to take advantage of this. If we play this right, San Luis Obispo will become a global leader for aerospace innovation. If we play this right, the employment and economic benefits of this growth in San Luis Obispo will surpass the growth in any other industry. The promotores, they have put aside their own health to protect the health of their community. They have built that trust with their community. They are leaders in their community. They are well known and they bring the right resources. I tried to calculate for you guys the amount of uh, miles and time I've spent riding in the Central Coast. And I think it's somewhere around 25,000 miles. Um, in uh, 80 days of riding. And it was really the breeding ground for the Olympic dream. People who get the COVID vaccine, but sadly get COVID are not nearly as sick or risking hospitalization. Getting vaccinated yourself may also protect the people around you. The animals on the central coast are, you know, they're probably looking around at each other and asking, where the heck are all these people coming from? People freed from their student life or, or their office duties, packed up their laptops and jumped in their vans and Subarus. And, and a lot of them came to the central coast and they came to the Los Padres National Forest and the Carrizo Plains in unprecedented numbers. Um, people rediscovering or discovering the outdoors is a silver lining, I and mean, that's a great thing. Advice for being more inclusive and diverse is really stepping outside of your comfort zone. Ask questions and be open to conversation. We want to do more than just take. We want to provide. The aim is to restore abundance to the ocean while solving some of the world's biggest societal challenges. Our vision and that of the majority of the industry is an upscaled, responsible, and restorative seaweed industry. Every interaction with police, no matter how small, can have a huge impact on the individuals, uh, the lives of the people that we serve. You know, a lot has changed in our world in the past year, and uh, our communities demand and deserve the very best police services possible. As a police chief, it's my responsibility to make sure we're delivering those services with the best people possible. We aren't here despite our struggles, we're here because of them. Even though it's hard to see that when we're in the midst of it, I think that, that all of us, all of our local businesses in our community and our country as a whole, um, I really think that true growth and transformation happens amidst the struggles.